hey guys come along with me as i show you this luxury villa situated in tamarin and if you do not already know tamarin is in the west of mauritius it is just after flick and flack now one beautiful thing besides this up uh, this villa being a luxury villa is that it has a view and i cannot wait to show you guys what the view looks like I would also be talking about how much this apartment costs and what the rooms are and everything it has to offer. Besides this house having a really good front yard and entrance, it also has a spacious backyard like we will call it in Nigeria. Basically, this backyard is giving everything it's supposed to give with the view. I was literally perplexed. Not like I haven't seen the ocean before, but imagine waking up and sleeping and looking at this view every single day. Now, this is the second entrance for the guest house and the studio apartment. And this is another sit out, you know, if you want to grill, you have your friends over it's chilled you guys can sit there it also comes with a pool although when i filmed this video the pool wasn't clean because it's not been occupied for a while but definitely it will be clean if you are living there now you guys one thing i need to put out there is that i also noticed this house is not child proof so if you are thinking of taking this house just make sure that your child is safe because it doesn't have a fence and children tend to wander sometimes do you see that white thing that's the thing you use you they used to see no use helicopter to see i'll show you oh, the, underwater. the under yeah underwater waterfall yeah are you serious yeah yeah, yeah. No. guys can you see that white spot that yeah. white spot is the underwater waterfall. Wait, where is that the mountain point? No, it's still up on the mountain. It's still up. No, like this video is yeah. currently sponsored by Property Link. They are an agency here in Mauritius and they can cater to your housing needs. Whether you're looking for something long term or short term, they would always have something within your budget. You can also find Property Link on Facebook. I'm going to put in the link in the description box. And you can also get the number of the agent who helped me get this house for viewing in the description box as well. So I want to show you guys what the rooms are and then we'll start with the smaller rooms before I show you the master bedroom. So let's go guys. This house is giving me everything it should give me. And then welcome to the first room. I really like this room and everything it's giving. I actually don't want to talk too much. I just want you guys to see every single thing this room is giving. This is what I want to be doing every morning when I wake up. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that.
guessed right i am just in front of the master's bedroom but i wanted to tell you guys what this house cost i'm sure you're already thinking well this house costs 870,000 rupees which is excluding the guest house that has two rooms and then one studio all in suite now if you're going to be taking the studio and the two rooms in the guest house you'll be taking it for 250,000 rupees now that 250,000 rupees is excluding the monthly deposit and the agency fee so let me show you guys what this master bedroom looks like i can sleep in this room all day every day anytime any day look at the bed The long balcony is giving me everything it's supposed to be given guys and it has two balconies well there's supposed to be a TV here because of that and this couch you know maybe when you have visitors I know I didn't show you guys, but this room doesn't need an air conditioner. All you need to do is just open the doors and you're fine. It just has one fan and I feel like that fan is very inconsequential at this point. But let me show you guys what the bathroom looks like. So people can just use this bathroom in peace, you know? And then we have this. And then, I mean, the best one of them all because I mean I like this one a lot which is this one we have an outdoor shower for the days you don't feel like being inside and you want to shower outside naked obviously yeah you get the point I'll definitely need a walk-in closet and baby now one good thing I like about it is that it's enough for two people to stand in here and as well as you know once you bring this out it gives you enough room enough room anyway guys that is enough for the master bedroom let's just go see what the other rooms have to offer dining area this is a five seater and this I don't know how many seaters this is there are so many stairs and you guys there's a swing there is a lounge area here at this kitchen I definitely know that if this is a Nigerian house there will be at least three fridge in this kitchen because this house is way too big for that fridge oh there is a double door fridge so let's go check the double door fridge Once you're done cooking, you just come out and then again the pool there's here and there's also the lounge area that I've shown you guys earlier on. Let's go back inside the house guys. Let's the 
wooden floors are giving me everything that it should be giving me. Now this bathroom. Again, this room has two balconies. Every room has a balcony, guys. Every room has a view. Every room is well ventilated. Nothing screams comfort more than this. I mean, after a long day, I just sit here, read a book, and I look at this very, very beautiful view. Okay, let's go check the other room. I think this room is a bit smaller, but I love this. Comes with this wooden and glass covered wooden. Again, TV is meant to be here. It has a bathroom, but I think we've seen too much of bathrooms already. So I am going to the last room. Is a second master bedroom guys let me know in the comment section which master bedroom do you like I think I prefer this one but upstairs because I feel it's too downstairs and it's more accessible but either ways it's gated so you wouldn't have any exact same thing with the first one and that is a walk-in closet exact same model guys so. the only difference with this bathroom is there is no door here showing you um, the outside shower but hey, love the lights in the bathroom and love the shower as well. Beautiful. This I think I like this kitchen setup too. But this is an empty. Is there any other lights in that room? No finished. <laughs> I can see you going back. <laughs> Okay, this is actually very big for a studio. No, it's low, but it's big enough.
Yeah. Now this has a separate parking and a separate entrance. Okay. Now this apartment is way smaller, way smaller. Guys, the wardrobe is massive. The bed is here as well. To be honest, if you've been to the big one, entering the small one, you wouldn't really appreciate the quality. But if it meets your budget, then why not? Thank you. 